How are y'all doing today? Good, good. Gotta speak into this one here. Yes. Gotta speak into it. So, so who here is excited to see? You gotta speak into it. Who here is excited to see Ishmael Mohammed become the next state representative for this district? This is new. Ah. We, wait, what was that? How many of y'all are excited to see Ishmael Mohammed? Oh, that's a little bit better. That's a little bit better. How y'all doing? My name is uh, David Herwin. I'm the MC for this event. I'm also going to help with canvassing and some um, communications and outreach for this campaign. I'd like to welcome you all here today for this. This one. All, both of these, all of these. I'd like to welcome you here today for this historic announcement of an historic campaign. Uh, for somebody in a majority minority district to actually stand for the will of the people in this time where we have almost no representation in the state house. We need the louder voices. Um, I'd like y'all to remember that this is for the state house primary election, which includes representative uh, races for state representative and state senator. This election will be held Tuesday, August 2nd, and uh, voter registration is open until Tuesday, May 5th, with uh, the early vote beginning Wednesday, July 6th, at the Franklin County Board of Elections. So, if you're not registered now, please do so. Every vote counts, every vote matters, and they only count if you actually go out and do it. I would uh, first like to welcome to the podium for an opening prayer, Imrad Malik. Pastor Emmanuel. Pastor Emmanuel, would you like to start us with an opening prayer instead? Sure. Thank you. Good afternoon. All heads bow, eyes closed. Gracious and eternal Heavenly Father, we thank you for this time and space and opportunity to come to you collectively as a community to push our community forward. We thank you, God, for your grace, for your mercy, and for your loving kindness towards us. We also thank you for the candidate that is running. And God, we ask that your grace will rest upon him. Lord God, bless this meeting today, this press conference. Do as only you can with us, through us, and in us. In your name we pray. Amen. Bismillah. <clears throat> I will say it both in English and Somali, uh, since Imran is not here. Um, we ask God Almighty to bless Brother Ismaili's work, and we ask God Almighty to make Brother Ismaili one who leaves an everlasting legacy for generations to come. And we ask God Almighty to use us all that which pleases Him to make us those who lend a helping hand to humanity. Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim wa haan insha'Allah ta'ala ilahi subhanahu wa ta'ala uwi dinayna wa lalkin sma'il in u ubarakayyo mashru'an u istaga u madad wa haan ilahi uwi dinayna in u isma'il kadduwa mit kattaga raad la mahadiyo in u ufudaydiyo wa fachiyana masuliyaddan u isu taagay jazakum allahu khairan ameen I would now like to I have the great pleasure of calling my friend and activist community advocate Miss Jasmine Ayers to the podium okay can everybody hear me yes. all right I am honored to be here today um, I was born and raised on the north side of Columbus I'm a proud Northland graduate like my friend Ishmael um, and I I know I know that he is going to be the best representative for our neighborhood someone who grew up who went to the YMCA and played someone who went to the Carl Road library someone who understands what Carfanias meant to Northsiders in Columbus so we are extremely honored to have him running for office um, he graduated from Ohio State with a bachelor's in political science and then completed law school from the Ohio State University. He was the first Somali lawyer to pass the Ohio bar. This is a, a yes, clap it up. This is a extremely smart, extremely thoughtful, extremely caring person 
who really wants to focus on making sure that our career and technical institutes are available for all of our youth and that we're starting early, right? You shouldn't have to wait to high school to learn a trade, right? He wants to make sure that all of our youth and all of our neighborhoods have access to quality career tech, career technical programs, which he actually completed and he can do your, he can design your website and write some code because he has a background from high school in computer science. And he wants to make sure that we are taking care of and thinking about the diversity in Columbus and using it to its full ability. We have a wonderful rainbow here in this city and we want to make sure that everybody is valued, everybody is heard, everybody's voices is li are lifted up. And Ishmael is going to make sure that everybody in this district um, has their voice heard. Like I said, he's smart, he's thoughtful, he's caring, he's a wonderful husband and a wonderful father. And I'm just so proud uh, to say that I support him. Um, and really looking forward to what it looks like to have elected officials who are transparent, who are showing us and teaching us what it looks like uh, to be good stewards of the law. So uh, I appreciate this opportunity. Congratulations, my friend. I look forward uh, to when you win. Thank you, Jasmine. Uh, I would now like to call up to the stage uh, Dr. Emmanuel Anthony. All right, good afternoon once again, family. Again, um, I am um, not originally from here. However, I've served in this community for several years, uh, for the last 10 to 15 years. And I had the honor and privilege of seeing this community grow. But more importantly, I had the honor and privilege to see it change and watch that wonderful rainbow that my sister just alluded to. This is, in fact, a rainbow, but we are, in fact, one family in this district. I'm supporting um, uh, Brother Ishmael uh, for a couple of reasons. Number one is because he champions the causes that means the most to us. Things like affordable health care, mental health services. His whole campaign is centered around economic empowerment and development, making sure that those businesses, small businesses that are struggling in the community can in fact access funds and wealth so that they can sustain themselves through COVID-19 and beyond. I'm supporting him not only because he's a father, a lawyer, but also he's an advocate and a trusted friend. You know, they talk so much about diversity. And in the words of Maya Angelou, she said these words, and I love it. She said, diversity is being invited to the party, but inclusion is being asked to dance. And so what we want to do is we want to push him to the place where he can dance and make the necessary changes in this district for all of us. Thank you, Pastor. Thank you, Pastor, and thank you for the uh, pinch hit for us and those kind words. I would now like to call up to the podium a dear friend of Ishmael's, uh, Mrs. Fields. Miss Fields, are you around? There she is. Come on. Mike is tricky. You're speaking in the phone. Okay. Well, welcome, and it is such a privilege to be here in the support of Ishmael. Um, he's touched my heart in so many ways, just being a leader. His integrity is, I, I, it's of the highest, and I am honored to be a friend of his. In voting for him, he makes a difference, and that's what I love. He will make a difference. Some of my students, um, when I told them about him running, they got excited. I wish that they could vote, and they also wish that they could vote. One of the things that I ask for you to do is pray for him, pray for his strength, pray for his family, pray that he will continually to honor his God. That is so important, and I thank him for that. Make sure you encourage everyone that you know to please go out and vote. I have students that will be going out 
and uh, canvassing the areas and taking tracks, please, 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 in all your doings, vote. It's very important, not just for Ishmael for his win, but also for our community. And that is so important. So thank you. Thank you, Representative. Um, thank you, Ms. And thank you again, Ms. Fields. Um, it seems to be early on a lot of love for Ishmael, right? Because, I mean, the thing about love is you it's gauged by how much you give. And he's obviously given a lot. So there's another uh, couple people coming up. Um, next we have, aha, we have a mic now. Next we have Zerka Abid. Good afternoon. Asalaamu Alaikum everybody. Um, I feel very honored to be here to support Ismail who is who has been around for a very long time. Can you guys hear me? It's good? Okay. So I'm Zerka Abid. I'm a community leader serving Central Ohio since 2007 in different capacities, but especially been working around gangs, drugs, um, youth issues, social services, mental health issues, affordable housing, all of that that is listed on Smiles uh, issues. And I have seen him. I have seen him working along all over Central Ohio, but for this district also, I have seen him helping and being there when we need him there. So I am so happy to see that this young man, who I'm very proud of, is running for election for the district that he is serving already in so many different capacities. And that's what we need from the leaders. We get people who come, they run, and then they figure out what they want to do for the district. And you have people who actually have been around and doing their job, title or no title, money or no money, they're there. And that's what you need. That's what you need when you go to vote, that you know, know that what is the character of this person? What is their passion? What are they going to do for me? And Ismail is one of those that when he called me, I felt that I cannot say no. I will come and proudly support Ismail. And what I want to say, what I want to say about Ismail is that not only that he is a father and a lawyer and a committed community member, I want to say that there are things that really is important for us to know. And those are the things that he is very respectful. He is very respectful and he is inclusive. The reason you are seeing the diversity for the, from the people who are supporting him today is because he is inclusive and he has been in the circles where maybe other traditional people won't go. But he is there. And you know, for me, that is important. Being mindful. Being able to work with women. Being able to respect women leaders. Being able to include them and uh, understand that the women can bring a change and you're not supposed to tear them down. This is such an important characteristic from our men leaders that we need the sisters. We need that kind of you know, mentality from our, women, our men leaders that we see in a smile. A Somali young man who is here in Columbus with second largest population of Somali Muslims, but there are 200,000 estimated number of Muslims. And here is a man who has been in all these circles, have worked with men and women, respected them, and, and really worked along with them. So I am proudly, proudly endorsing a smile, and I give him my word that I will do anything that I can to help him win this election. And I hope all of you do will do. Thank you. Uh, thank you for those words as well. Um, so, uh, again, there seems to be a lot of understanding that we're talking about an historic and important campaign here, right? The next person who's coming onto this stage is someone I've also known for quite a few years. 
He has worked tirelessly both in the community and most recently in the State House in the Ohio 25th District. Ladies and gentlemen, I give you Representative Dontavius Geralds. Listen, this is a celebration. Let's let's clap it up for Ismail running for office. Right. I think we can do a little bit louder than that, but let's clap it up for Ismail running for office, y'all. Right. So, welcome to the House District 25 until December. Uh, I'm so glad to have you in my district and a district that I have grown and loved for a very long time, even before I was elected. I remember walking these streets, working with Jasmine, doing everything we can to lift up families so that we can build a better Ohio for all of us. And for context, redistricting changed the maps in Franklin County. I am now in District 1, which includes Bexley and Franklinton and German Village and only Linden up to the 17th. So where you're standing right now is in District 3 that Ismail is running for. And I say that for context because myself and Representative Humphrey are only two of 11 House members who are African American that serve Franklin County. Two of 11. And it's important that we think as the lines shift and change as communities move and break apart, unfortunately due to gerrymandering, that we maintain consistency and representation in districts that are majority minority. And that's why I hear, am here today. That's why I support Ismail. Because it's important that we have a voice at the table who can speak about equity and inclusion. Who can speak about implicit bias. Who can speak about what it means to struggle to put food on your table because you don't have, you have enough more bills than you have money that you can speak about affordable housing issues and eviction. You can speak about workforce development and the reality that we need to get not just $15 minimum wage, but $25 minimum wage, to be, to be quite frank. These are the conversations that are happening at dinner tables all across this district. These conversations. And you want someone in office who can speak not only from experience, but has a plan forward to make some changes. As an elected, I say this all the time, and we talked about, Jasmine talked about a rainbow coalition, not to quote Jesse Jackson, <laughs> but we talk about what does it mean to have inclusive leadership at the table? And what does it mean when you have people who look like you at the seats of power speaking on your behalf? That's well, that's what's at stake this election. That is at stake this election. I'm going to say it again. That is at stake this election. And so August 2nd, it is estimated that only 2 to 4 percent, 2 to 4 percent of our community is going to vote. And unfortunately, that could very well change who represents a community like Linden a community like Capitol Park, a community like Joyce Avenue, a community off of Morse Road, two to four percent. And so I'm standing here today supporting Ismail because he's the right candidate, because it's the right thing to do, because we need representation that looks like us, because we have people who, are need, who need his voice at the State House. That is why I'm here. And I need a partner. Because while he represents most of Linden, I represent some too. And it's important that we work together for the needs of Ohioans in this district and for the entire state of Ohio. And so without further ado, I am proud to introduce the next state representative for the third house district, Ismail Mohammed, y'all. Let's give it up. Thank you so much. Thank you, Representative Geralds. Thank you so much to every other speaker that was out here. Uh, Jasmine Ayers, my good friend. Go Vikings. God bless you. We went to Northland High School together. Uh, and I want to thank uh, uh, Pastor Emmanuel Anthony, uh, Sister Zerka Beat, uh, Brother Horsed, 
and all the other speakers that spoke about our amazing campaign kickoff. I am excited. I am pumped as hell. Are we pumped as hell? Yeah. <laughs> Let's hear it. I kind of want to start by talking a little bit about kind of my journey to public service. Uh, you know, as you all know, I was born in Somalia in 1992. I, you know, we, I lived through a civil war. I've lived through hardship and persecution and poverty. And we were among one of the very few families that had an opportunity to come to America. And, uh, and America is the greatest country in the world. A country where it doesn't matter where you were born, where you grew up, what religion you have, you can come here, play by the rules, and get ahead in life and live up to your highest expectations. That is the greatness of this country that kind of forced me to come into public service. I went to Northland High School, proud graduate, and I then went on to The Ohio State University, uh, getting my bachelor's in uh, political science. And, and then I went back to OSU again for the second time and went to Moritz College of Law and received my uh, law degree. And I chose that field for a reason. A lot of my you know, family, cousins, friends of mine ended up in medical school or the medical field. Uh, I chose law for a reason. The legal field is such a critical field that affects every aspect of your life, whether it's housing, whether it's education, whether it's public safety, all of it kind of there's that niche that affects all of it which is the law you have to be able to pass legislation you have to be able to advocate for policy to bring about change that is the reason why I chose law to study and I started my own practice and have been an advocate for the community I do a lot of immigration law I also do a lot of personal injury I do a lot of work with uh, landlord tenants I've been able to help a lot of victims with uh, evictions as COVID was going on. So I've been someone who's been in the community for a long time. But the best opportunity for where I felt that I could have the biggest impact was to be able to run for political office. Uh, I was kind of getting, uh, in a way, frustrated with being able to have some minor changes with individual clients. To be, bring about a massive change, you have to be able to have a macro effect publicly. And that is through legislation, that is through public policy. And that is the reason why I'm running here today. So I've lived in the third district most of my adult life. Uh, like I indicated, I graduated from Northland High School and have, have been a resident now for over 18 years. And I understand what the issues are. Uh, with COVID happened, we all know some of the major issues that we're dealing with now. And that starts with unemployment and public safety. Um, shortage issue with housing. And there is a big housing crisis that's happening in Franklin County. And uh, my goal is to make sure that I am an advocate for that to make sure that we have affordable housing available to every single family. No family. No family should have to either move to a different district or move to a different state because they don't have affordable housing. That is one of the key pillars that I'm running on. I'm also running to make sure that we have, we deal with the healthcare issue we have in this country. God bless, the, God bless Obama for the work that he did, President Obama, because we have now the Affordable Care Act. Our goal is to make sure that we fight in every legislator in the country to make sure that we are expanding the Affordable Care Act. As you know, there's been a nonstop assault on the Affordable Care Act from different states to make sure that they are cutting the Affordable Care Act. We will fight alongside Representative Geralds and others in the Democratic Caucus to make sure that we are expanding the Affordable Care Act, that we are expanding more funding for mental health services and other key services in the healthcare department. No family should have to worry about either paying rent or uh, taking care of their family's health care medical needs. And that is one of the key pillars that I'm running on. I think a, a couple of folks, including Jasmine and Pastor Emmanuel Anthony, I think touched on the importance of having diversity at the State House. As you all know, the 3rd District is one of the most diverse districts in the state of Ohio. It has a large a, a multi multitude of different ethnicities, different religions, and it's one of the reasons why it's really transformed into a such a beautiful hub. If you drive down Cleveland and Morse Avenue, you, you can see some of the changes. Some of the folks that have been here for over 20 years, they noticed that a lot of those areas were pretty empty now there's there's a vibrancy there's so many small business owners that are starting businesses there's so many entrepreneurs that are creating opportunities for youth I want to make sure that they have a voice at the State House I will vow to be a rep thank you 
I will vow to be a representative for every single resident in the third district. My goal is we're going to have an aggressive canvassing, and I want to make sure that I'm reaching out to every single voter in my district to talk about the issues that matter to them. So then I can take that to the state house and be an advocate for them. I will vow to make sure that I am I'm having listening tours, I'm attending meetings to make sure I'm hearing some of the issues that are going on. Because I know with every community and every district, there might be slight differences in issues, but for the most part, we're all dealing with a lot of the same issues. And I understand a lot of the, what those issues are. I've lived through them personally. I grew up in a low-income neighborhood. Uh, I went to public schooling for my education. And I, we want to make sure that we're, we are providing more funding for public education, for our youth, for our kids. And I want to make sure every single child, regardless of where they live, or what zip code they have, they have an opportunity to get the best education possible so they can go to college and live up to their expectations. I'm also very much passionate about economic development and jobs and small business. As you all know, Columbus is a small business city. It has a couple of hundred small businesses. Most of those are small businesses, and a lot of them have struggled with COVID. You all know that we've a lot of businesses have had to shut down, unfortunately, due to COVID. And one of the things that you know, Representative Geralds and other Democratic colleagues that we're working on is to make sure that we are advocating for more funding, more support, more grants and opportunities for small business leaders. That way, they can they can they can stay open and they can hire other youth and other leaders to be a part of their business. So that's another key aspect that I'm running on as well. I want to also touch on a couple of key aspects. I want to make sure that folks are aware of this special election because it is going to be a critical election that a lot of folks don't know. Uh, we know that the primary already happened on May 3rd. This is a special election. As I believe David indicated as well, the last day to register is going to be July 5th. So if you are not registered, then please make sure to register. We're going to need every single voter, not only your vote, but your family, your neighbors, your friends. You have to, we have to you know, hit the campaign trail really hard to make sure that you are advocating for every single person that you know, that they are aware of the special election that's going on, and they are aware of our candidacy. I do want to also touch on uh, the early vote. That's going to be starting on July 6th. That will run until August. Please make sure that you can come out and vote. We're trying to make sure that as many folks as possible come out during early vote to support our campaign. I have so many things I could say, but I know that you guys have been standing here for over an hour. I want to keep it as brief as I can, but thank you so much. I am so excited for this election. We are going to make history here in Ohio. Thank you so much, and God bless. Well I think we can do a little bit better than that. Let's give it up for Ismail Muhammad. You know, we touched on something real quick, uh, and I'll just make this remark, and we'll do photos and shake hands and kiss babies, right? Um, the one thing that, if Ismail becomes the Democratic nominee for this general, he'll be one of the first Somali-American to ever be elected to the Ohio legislature. believe that they don't see themselves in the state house. It matters to our communities who are searching for connection to political power. And so whatever you do this election, make sure you tell the story of what this could mean for all of us. All of us. That is how we change and make Ohio better. And so I just wanted to say that and leave you with that, that, that departing gift, that this is history and where we're standing right now can make the difference between whether we actualize that history or it's just a blip or a footnote in the in the chain of life. And so thank you all for coming. I'm excited to be on the trail with y'all. السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته إن إن ما عيوا كوثر هل كان عاوز حوس قلبته حا ساك هل كان حوس استغني إن صبوسي نجرب وحسي إن إسماعيل محمد أو عرى ديستريكتري أو أحافظ وجبضن إسماعيل ذي مينورتي جاي دقيهن إن وحنا كعصر إن إسماعيل ملك استأجر جان فضلا إن صبوسي يعني إسماعيل وقفك وجهري أفريكانا أو مسلنا أو لقد دارن دارن استهدف أوهايو not only إسماعيل حتى أفريكانا سو جورة وحنا قن دارنا إن إن متقانا إن تسالة هي مسلمين أنت لما أنتوت إسماعيل مركز لبعض إسكت ده يواي واحد لو يقول استكلي أفر بقلع عد بس بلوجو يقول استي and هذا العضوين توحي بلام الساعة جولاي six وحين أكو أكتا أغسطس second مركو حلاقو عصنا يا دمانت كنا عضيان أدرس كواتقانا و seventeen 
100 and Morris Road, Columbus, Ohio, and Fadlan and, and Odeya, and Hafad Ismail, we have Kabila Mesa, North High Street, uh, starts with Morris Road by Kabila Mesa, goes south until 17th Avenue, and then North High Street until it starts the road. Marka Hawaii, Marka Morris, all the way to the High Street, Marka Haga Morris, we have to go to Hawaii, and it starts the 17th Avenue. Marka Hawaii, we have to go to Hawaii, and we have to go to Hawaii, and we have to go to Hawaii, dad kale dariska ay aan Soomaalida kaliya ahayn inay soo saaran dhamaantii waa mahasanti balanteen waxa waayay codaynta maanta codaynta inoo balanamaad een bismillahir rahmanir rahiim alhamdulillahi rabbil alamin wa sallallahu ala nabiyyina muhammad wa ala alihi wa sahbihi wa sallim een maanta waxaan isugu nimay een kulankan een aan qoraxda u taaganahay waa barbilowgii ismaaciil maxamed uu ku ordey tartankii uu ku saabsana een house of representative district 3 columbus ohio وردي إسماعيل يدين شريح مايو يدين شيق مايو أقون تيسا وحجرت كيسا وحتر كيسا منا يدين شيق مايو إسماعيل وويل لويرة وقرن سوماليات وأقون يهان سوماليات وويل خبط أولى إنه إنه مترو دمانتين هذول النهاي كوميونتي سوماليات ديستريك تريج أو ديستريج أو كوردي كولومبوس أوهايو واحد جرنا سان إنت أيلاكت هاي وحويه وضد السبنتين كلا يرادو إلى موريس رود إنت أودا حيسا أما هاي ستريد إلا استلسر إنت أودا حيسا محن كلا إيستيجا استلسر نورت كلا محن كلا هذا وستيجا نوا هاي ستريد and south كوا سبنتين ستريد دينا عن نورت كلا نوا موريس رود دمانتين واحد نكون بورنيا وحن نقول دونا هيستوري أيونو كان نقف كي وري سوماليا إنو جلا محن كلا جوري جلا جا أريميو جبل كأوهايو مجال ذا كولومبوس دمانتين سوماليا وحن لا يهاي هالله عذيو وحدوكتين إيرلي فودكو وحبلاب ميا أما عذين تهرى وحبلاب ميسا تشون سكن بحبلاب وحلا تشولاي سكن وحن نقول دمان سا تشون تشون تشولاي سكس أغسطس سكنا ويا دمانسا يا هلا جف في يوسف وقت هو وقت دو إسماعيل قول برتشينا يا عد كله ينوق بها يا وعد عادو ير ووح كير صدق كون يا مشان كون عد كير مرك دمانتين آدي بني سلامي بسم الله الرحمن الرحيم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته وعن ما تعلق أنا سكوني ملي أنا كودي رجلنا ولكن الدار ير أقوياء كيجا الله يا كيجا يا دولة كورة يعني كأسو استعجح اللي وانا إن شاء الله وحرجيني إن إن عن القناة قوة كقول استو هدي عاوز عن القناة دينا إسماعيل إسماعيل وهو هانين زيرو قصة بالعبي سيدا عنا عن رفيجيك كام أنت هو ولا نمد أنه من أمريكا أيو كريس وقاب غاتي وعنا صامرة إن الله شرنت يدبتها مركنا في جيب أبو أيو كسو جاري هيرك ومان تتعين وعن كل رجلنا إذا ما بدنا ليرا صامرة إمل والبجوتو إن سيدا إسماعيل هو نقضه هلا عايفتين كذا حم وضب بالشدة يجنا أقول ده يا شو ناقصن أيو سميان سيدا دارشة قاعد مغلى دانتنا واحد وسين دانا ولا الله أنت ذكرته والسلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته السلام عليكم هل كان وحن أجوجنا مركلة ولا كان إسماعيل أو ديستريكت سدحات ثير ديستريكت وأردايو إن عن مانتا إن جوبجوك إن كنا قلنا إنه إعلامي سي إن أوفيشلا إنه أوران قرينا مركا وحان دات كسومالي ده خاصة دات كدجن ديستريكت ثري عن كعد سنة يا ور هنا لا أجاد إن المجال ده دجن هاي مجال ده إن دجن هاي وحاي وحاتوسي كرا مركا يلانو ريبرسنتيف أنا كنا مثال مركا إن قفل با أو ديستريكت دجن هاو و استاو اینو اسماعیل نقض نیکی نمتلاعی اینو نقض نیکی نوهری آنگل استی رفسن استیفک اینو آهادو تصالح اینو اسماعیل آهادو قفکی نوهری آنگل استی رفسن استیفک اینو تصالح اون نقض دالن یارا دا همیو کجرو اینا ایگان و حنادان مگه حالا سپرتی کرایو سومالی دیگر دیستریکت ثری بلیس قفل بابا بی آور آگوست سلامیکم السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته معي وعبد آدم وعن من تعلق عن ديار أنهي ويسوقون مد إنه نتاجرنا ولكن إسماعيل محمد أو على يا ديسريك تري حد يعلي إنه وعن سمعنا نمرك الله ومرمانا إنه أمي ده هنا إنه صاصر نسنة كان قفص وماله آه وإنه متله سأنت أوجرنا وعن وبعنا إنه نسوى ذا نبعنا تشنو جو عن سنة ما دابوا يا هالك قف أو سماليا أو ترتمي بوسكان إن أنت تاجرنو سامال نبكو تاجرنو 
سلما كوتا غيرنو اهل نما كوتا غيرنو اينو غاما هاي سخبصنو ارنتا هاو استاغنو ارنتا هاو سنو كو غوليسينا و كو غوليسينا يا انكوة دو غوليسينا ان شاء الله مركو وحين كو عطسانا يا دمان دادك ديستري قدقن ان اي عطكو عطري سيان اسماعيل وحين كلو عطسانا يا دادك ديستري قدقن ان اي صابحان ان اي صابحان ان اي صابحان او شاقدا وحكا قبطان دغالا كو بيحيان فرنتير قريان او صابحان اسماعيل اد باو ما سنتين السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته نقول لي ما انتو حاسكون ميد مشان ان انا تاجر نو اسماعيل محمد ان اسماعيل وحو ترتمي يا ديستريك 3 ان اي ريفورينك وحو بلاباني يا جولاي سيكس وحارتشين انا قفو البو او ريجسر انا حين انو يمادو او ريجسر اسكاديقو ان الكشن ريقو حين نقوني سا اغوص تو مركا وحا دوني انا قفو البو انو منطقة انا اسماعيل تاجر واغلال كان وحارم ناقف كي أهري أو كلام مسكوس صباحا إنه نقضى إن إن شاء الله إسماعيل قول يا أروشينينا السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته بسم الله الرحيم إن معي وأبكر هاي سنة أبكر سنة إن كم إذا معناها إن جليد كلام مسكوس هاي مثلا ما أنتوا حاسوا معنا هول ما أدمهم وأح إن وأح إن ولا لكن إسماعيل متقانا وأدلو يقال ما هذا متقانين رأه إن أترى سمعت كور معنا إن إنه نقضى معنا إن مثل قبل كان ما دق ما دق معنا دق إنه هاي كلام بس أخايو هذا معناه أوسع هذا إنه هذا معناه مركلة سو نقضى هذا نترتمو إن كل دورش دم دورش معناه هواي سكر لوس أجسم هواي مركا إن إسماعيل نم تقرا إن ونن آدي آد معناه إن أقرح مقضى إن إن شاء الله تعالى ذلك الدورن دونه مركو حرم إن متى نكبر إن أمان والله سمع هذا قبل ك أخاي قال هذا مجاذا كلام بس قال أهان معناه دسري تقرا من دك متى من تجد حد أو أي معناه دورش دم قال كذا عيسو إن أوسع بحان إن شاء الله إن عدك هذا كينان إني كريب غاتان دار شذا إن أول فوتي كأمة تانا عذن تبعنا وقت غرب بلبنان شو بلبنان سام تانا إن جلا بس جلا سال الله هذا بلبنان سا إن دار شذا نبعنا غاس كانوا هيك وقتها يوم تانا دولة هذا بس شو أقول سلبة هذا يوم وقتها إن شاء الله بركم حنا لما ولا الله سبحانه قبل كوهاي جارهن مجالد أنا كلام بسوا هاي جارهن دك ما تجد حد إني أصاب بحان أعذر ولكن إسماعيل أو مظن لما تلو إن أو مظن إنه معناه إن هو كان كم معناه دود بوشيدنا متنا قريب كان هذا نون لما تلو حفيز الدولة دي مهم كم تقنا وها قبل كنا إن أو هاي جارهن مجالد أنا كلام بس جارهن إن دك ما تجد حد وما تجدين السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته وحال إذا هم جاي جواهي بإسمان عمر وحن كنا له هاي قبل كأوهاي دق مدا كولومبوس أوهاي وحن هل كانوا إم إن صبر جريا إسماعيل أو أهن آدي آد أقل ما إن أقل ما بدن إن صبرتين إن صبر جريا مهم أي تاي مركا وحن آد وجعلها إن تك سوماليات مركا واجانس وأنا وأنا رول مودل كعروتينا مركا وحن دون يا إن لو صبحه أو لا صبر جريا أو لقى فائدة استو أنا جانا أنا وفاء إدينو مركا أي صبر هندر بيرسنت إسماعيل سومالي ده نهصو بحده كل جانا ويا ريدي شاء الله السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته ما جاي يشرب عليه هاي شيء مواجه وحن كم بده هاي وضيع شيء مجال كولومبوس هل كنا وحن أمي مد إن صبرت جرينا ويل كيما إسماعيل أتوني إسماعيل أو أه من أنكو أقانو من كرتيلة مجتمع وحقوق بتا وحن أقانا إسماعيل يرنتي سيلا هذا نقانا وحن كو أقانا من رون يقانو ذات كان وحقوق بتا مركو وحن رجعيني ناس ومالي إن إسماعيل سبورت الله سيو سونا وفريس ثم تقانا أو أتجو كوب شيء سوقات سو وحقوق بتا مجتمع والسلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته مقا عيجو وشاكر وحن كم لهذا نيرة ما قال الله كل مسوا هايو وحن ما أنت سو سو بحني كان بين كيكوف ورالك إسماعيل أوتر تما إن ديستريكت ثري إن أجو إن دورشود واحد بلبنان سا أرلي فورينك إن جولاي سكس لاس دي أو إلكشن كده عينه وحاوي إن وأجوس الله بده دواي لما نجلي ده كلام مسوا هايو وحن قاصرنا أنا صبحان إن تاجران ورالك إن إن وحنا استد ككرية إن سمارد أوبرانتا أو إلا هذا أنا لقيه إن قفل أنا رأه أم قفل سماريات أنا متلعي استدين أنا جريان أسمارد كده تصير مين أو كله سيار الله كله أيها سماريد الله قدرت عيب أيها نقطة هاي أنا قرر نقول كيا سو إن أنا هاي لا لحدن إلا تضبط كنا قف إن أنا سو سارو إنه مقالة أنا أكون والله مدرسة صار كبرن إن هل قف أنا سو سارو إنه ما كده ما عنصر مالذي كلام مسوا حق أصلا يا إن أنا كنت أجرنا مال إن أنا كنت أجرنا فولنتير يحقن إن أنا كنت أجرنا عد كنا ضد كأن رجس كأن إذا إذا فت رجس قرية سأو عذسان مرك فضل إمالة صبحة وأنا عذنا مرك عمل هذا جونو أنا كهل لأنه حن القطاع أو هاي وحما يستان وأنا عرفت سنة جهرتا وما سنتين السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته مجيء أيوة عبد الله قاسم مجالا كلهم بس العبارة ودقناها مرك هو حلوبة هنا إن مجالا ده يلا تمان تقف كصبحة أو وهل جماعة دكتور لينتين سوماليات قف حتى معنا بريء كده ينكران يديه كران 
قفكاس حلب وساقبتي أنا أنا جنا ودي سرعنا نركا هرتو حاجة جيرو لا جو جمعت هالكان ريبرسنتيف جيرو أو سنة كهرة إسماعيل كبدي مع أحمد جامع كبدي إسماعيل مهن مركا حضرت لنا سجع إمادي أو تاجيرا أو تاجيرا إنه حيهد كلهم سوا حكد عاي وحيد هان جيري ماندرين دكتوريجي يا لكلو روريجي يا لكل يا 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 لكل قيبي مركا قيب كميت أه يهاد أوردا إسماعيل قيب كميت أه نقولي إن يركب كله أو ماذا وجرر وهاي استقولي مركو حفلة لا أنا قيبته أنا وحي 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 حفل سعرن تايلا يكبت الباك إلى لندن هل كان أجونا كبت الباك إلى يكور إلى إمورس كل والوجان دونا أنت هاي إن أنت هسئلي نقول دونا هذه أنا قاعد أسوي بحننا إن إن وحفلة سو مالك اللي نسو صاير كرت إنك سو إنك سو هذا تارجت كون نقول دونا هذو إلى يراد عدول بين التارجت كريه ويسوي ضب حول لفود كريه إن كم بين كذو بلاده right now هدرت إنه بلاده إن شاء الله وكيف قادم دونا إن شاء الله أوكي السلام عليكم ورحمة الله وبركاته عاد بان أسود ويني يا أنا سلام يا سومالي بالشدة عرير وحاي يكون مريك دبا مقاعي قوي إسماعيل محمد سان وذو وقتين كل يوم إن شاء الله وحن كتير نهدي أول الشدي دور الشدة وهذا نوع فرمة دي إن شاء الله مركز ديجان كسدحات أو كلامز أو هاي أترتم بق النقص صعدة مركز سومالي دقن كلامز دم بوحن جالسين فلن دور الشدة مهم كل يوم هاي إن صباحه إن عضيه يعني مدة صدق شيء بالاسف ده هذا سو مال هذا وهذا مركي أفراد وحرشين لما كان بقول كي بقول قوش نعني نتاعي إن شاء الله بروشة سالو جارسين مهمكو بيش جولاي بيش تضباد لحد هذا عدكو فرمنا يا مركب فلان كهر قفكو يزدي وانجلين كرا أسبوع تجارين كرا قفكو دوات شو دحين هذا مره عضي سو كوتشر تاو عضين كرتا جولاي لحد هذا وتاريخ عدكو فرمنا يا وحنا نقول عضين يا مورسود ولا هذا سعودين بورد في لكشن كا وكيا على مورسود و 1700 مورسود من سو عدكو فرمنا يا ون سو عندنا إلا أغس لبده هذا أغس لبده هذا قدم بيس عدكا مركا قوش ودنا عيني بيحكي تابع قول كيو بقول سو مالدنا عضو إبهان تاني هالشو قبل كوهاي مدير بعد جنين قفنا حلبان مهرن أدب ما سدين جزاك الله خيرن